going on YouTube? It's the Green Shiz. Got an epic mail day opening. Got some stuff from, I think, Japan. Got some graded cards from Ludkins. And truth be told, I have no clue what is in this box. From Ludkins. So this was sent a while ago. I think this was an express sent through Ludkins. Ludkins received the cards back from CGC. They received them from CGC. Not a single card had a subgrade, even though the whole lot was supposed to have subgrades. So they had to resend them back to CGC. CGC had to regrade them, all while they're getting compiled with tons and tons of different grade cards to be graded. So this feels kind of heavy. I legit have no clue what this is. Hopefully it's some good stuff, because I'm looking for some good stuff. Hope everyone's doing great. Alright, we got at least six cards in here, and this one might be full. What the hell is this? Let's see if this can ring a bell. Oh, Moo Moo Milk. Okay, so this is some band cards. Okay. Small Recollection. A Unlimited Jungle. Interesting. Hopefully any of these I submitted get decent grades like this. Can't complain about a 9. Okay, nine Pidgeot. Just I just completed the entire CGC nine base set. So let's get a CGC nine jungle set, eh? Why not? Why not? I swear to God, they copy grades. That's crazy that all these are getting nines. Okay. I see you, 9.5 pincer. Alrighty then. Not bad. Must have been a minty set I bought. Do not remember doing that at all. wonder if there's any other band arts in here. Yep, this box is full. Legit had no recollection of that. Okay. We're getting there. So this is all jungle cards. Three, four, five, six. We're almost halfway for a complete jungle set. Victory belt. Hey, five, you dirty bitch. What oh, the hell's wrong with you? Damn, eight fives. I was killing my ass. Ooh, a nine Lapras. These boys are clean. Eight, five. What the hell did I submit? A base set two, mute two. Okay, that's random as hell. I guess I was just submitting nice, clean cards. It would appear that way. we got in here another meganium okay Ooh, a nine base set Ooh, I'm glad I didn't buy this that would have sucked a nine hit Montana oh. what else did I submit eight five Zam glad that didn't come back a nine I just bought a nine I would have cried uh, that'll tell you that I did not know these were coming. Nine Polyrath. I did buy one of those. Big rip. 
Spent ninety nine, yeah, ninety nine dollars on one of those. Ooh, my Sky Ridge Reverse Pikachu. I ain't mad about it. They did me wrong on that surface. Jesus. This card had a the ding in the bottom. And literally besides that, this card's mint. Not, I guess not mint because I got eight. All that cornering because of that one thing. But. Eight five Nittle King. Whoa. Guess I'm going to be throwing up some auctions because... Nine? Okay. I'll take a nine Zapdos. Put that in the collection. That's all she wrote for those. Let's get in this box. Hope everyone's having a great day. Buying and selling tons and tons of Pokemon cards. That is what I'm talking about. Can you guess the game? What is this game, chat? Comment down below what you think this is. This is Pokemon Stadium 1 from Japan. Epic. Look at the box art. The, bo the box is huge. Got the big three starters. Pikachu. This is complete in box. So unlike the games here in the U.S., this is how these games came. It came in this box. This is factory sealed basically there's no wrapping on them but they didn't come with wrapping on them out of the factory they just came in the cardboard boxes complete in box game these are cheap which is insane how much like i think this box was 70 dollars. this is how it came out of out of the factory if you look at any any Pokemon Stadium game U.S. made, you're talking three hundred plus dollars in the sealed box. No, loose. So if you have the loose box, you're looking three hundred plus. This one might be a middleman. Not too excited to open that. Put that aside. This one's another box from Japan. I'm going to make it, I just figured out today how to record my screen on my computer and record my audio. So I'll be doing some pro tips on eBay that I use when searching for things to buy, trends. Always want to be careful cutting these open because you can cut your cards, cut the games. Don't be that guy. We got here. Down she goes. How's that Nintendo King looking? To... Need a bigger desk. So this looks like the same thing. This one has a seal on it. Obviously, you can tell it's been opened. But these came to the stores without seals. This is a complete in-box Pokemon Stadium 1. In Japan, they had three. They had Pokemon Stadium 1, Pokemon Stadium 2, had a Mewtwo, and also the starters. 
Pokemon Stadium 3 was the same as R2. So I had Lugia, Ho-Oh. So that's pretty awesome. That's about it for today. Um, I'll be throwing some of these probably up on eBay um, when I get a chance. Peace. Thank you.